I made an AI that plays Google Chrome's dinosaur game by itself. This is the game. You must have played it when your data expires, yeah? For making the game, I uh, did something. And after saving the code, I started writing my own code. And after five years of hardship, I think I made. <coughs> oh, what the hell? <coughs> okay, let's do one thing. Um, uh, no, nobody's seeing. Easy. So, the time has come to make the dinosaur play on its own. Hello. And for that, we'll use genetic algorithms and fit forward in neural networks. We also call this neuroevolution. Dude, relax. What are you talking about? You could just write two lines of code that tells dinosaur to jump when it's near any obstacle. Um, yeah, but that would be so easy and I may not be able to brag my coding skills. Also, unlike Python, c -sharp does not have any TensorFlow or Kira's library, nor they have any NumPy library. And even if it has, but that would be so easy and I may not be able to brag my coding skills. <clears throat> so let's do it. Okay, that was a little too much. Anyway. We'll start the simulation with 10 dinosaurs in each generation. Some of you might not be familiar with these terms. So what you can do is press that like button. <laughs> It's the 78th generation and still the progress is not satisfactory as a dino can't dodge the obstacles properly. I think the mutation rate is very high. Let's restart the simulation with 5% mutation rate.
okay it's pretty good now that it's perfect let's take this a step higher we'll do this in 3d okay i am now starting the simulation <clears throat> guys what's happening i think my pc is about to blast Subscribe to the channel.